Hello, good morning, and welcome to Brooklyn. morning guys so I guess that now is a good time as any to start the book net fest vlog Yay! Yay! I feel like this is not the best lighting is that better is this better I don't know it is Thursday August 31st and today is the day that I board a plane to transport myself to Florida for book net fest I'm at my parents house right now I'm very excited to just get to Florida and relax and have a good time it's been a very stressful last couple of days moving starting school vacation and best friend's wedding in 14 days is just too much for anybody I have to be driving back home very soon here so that I can call an Uber to take me to the airport. I got one of my bags here, my other bag is in the car. I haven't done any airplane travel since college. So everything that I've done travel wise, we've driven. So I've been able to take whatever I wanted in whatever size quantity I wanted, you know, no three ounce liquid rule. I'm realizing yesterday as I'm packing that I had no travel size anything. Of course I don't have time to go to Target. Forget it, I'm just gonna check the damn bag and bring whatever I want. Thankfully, Southwest has free baggage check. So I'm at home now. Oh, excuse me. I got everything packed up. I've got my luggage sitting out here waiting for my Uber driver to come get me. Next time you see me, we'll maybe be at the airport. Amazing showrunners here from <laughs> from making this happen, making this thing happen. Now it's bloody. So I'm having a lot of fun right now. <laughs> Drowned rat fun. <laughs> it's pouring rain and I am soaked. I don't even have my shoes on. You can't see my feet. I don't have my shoes on anymore because um, they're in this bag. And we're just waiting for our Uber and I'm cold. Freezing cold and it's going to lighten again. How many minutes? Oh, 
Oh my gosh, you can totally tell how wet this is. And oh, I'm so cold. Breakfast time. Yep. <laughs> this is the first real food I've had since yesterday morning. We are finally on our way to Harry Potter World. Woo! Woo! God, I suck at vlogging. I'm so Ew. not good at it. Most of my vlogging clips are of what I'm looking at, not my face. So many vlog montages today. There's gonna be lots of, let me pan and show you what we're doing today. Now Universal will forever have our fingerprints. The adventure begins. Yeah, I'm so excited. Is this in September? A majestical griffin. We have just arrived in the Lost Continent section of the park. I think we've only been here for like 10 minutes, 15 minutes. It's so hot. There are people that are wearing like pants and sweatshirts and stuff and coats. I don't understand. I see the Hogwarts Express. We are finally approaching Harry Potter World. Ah, I'm so excited. We finally made it. We finally made it. Hogsmeade, and I'm really glad I had my permission to be officially third year students. What do you think? Yep. <laughs> I feel hotter than the look, I think. I have to be honest, I kind of wish that the snow on top of the roofs were real <laughs> so that it would be a little bit cooler. What do I want to do first? Let's go inside somewhere. <laughs> you want to get the butterbeer? Yeah, I do want butterbeer. I don't butter think beer. I can drink beer right now. Oh no, it's not beer. It's like a butterscotch. Flushy. I have a dilemma. Do you want pumpkin juice or butterbeer? He had on a sweater <laughs> and a robe. I think I'm gonna get a it's gilly water. <laughs> pumpkin juice. You take a picture of your, of your butterbeer already? Oh yeah. <laughs> He's got gilly water. I got pumpkin juice. <laughs> My finger looks really hot, and I understand his pain. I don't think that's very nice to put their employees in full robes. I don't even care that I'm a sweaty mess. Photo op. I can feel my butt sweating to my shorts. <laughs> yeah, if you go to the bathroom, there's no getting it up. No, there will not be. Are you vlogging? <laughs> I am vlogging. And instantly, it's 100 degrees again. Yep. Our locker didn't open for us, but of course, the minute the attendant came over, yeah. it worked. Jordan and I just did the uh, castle ride. Pretty cool. We went through like all seven movies. <laughs> Love that ride. Yeah. Well, it feels like we you're were actually the, flying. The Quidditch thing was really cool. Yeah. That was cool. Yeah. I guess I never said like what I'm wearing. So of course, I had to wear a Harry Potter shirt, so I'm wearing a Must Be a Weasley shirt. Gryffindor shirt on. It's cool how they had us go through like the Chamber of Secrets and yeah. the Dementors, the, 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 the spider the spider thing, and the Basculus. Ba yeah, the dragon scared me when it breathed. Yeah, like because it was like, oh, it was like right on my head too. It was, it was <laughs> right on your seat. <laughs> and then I was like nervous that we were gonna get too much water on us because I don't want to mess up my hair. When we were waiting in line and it just like sweat all the way up my arm. <laughs> and it was so disgusting. <laughs> I mean, he didn't even. Like Didn't even try to avoid you. We're standing in line at the Ollivander's no, wand shop in Hogsmeade right now so that we can go back inside the air conditioning because it's a million because. degrees outside. <laughs> we didn't even get a video of you picking out your wand, Lainey. Oh, damn. <laughs> Which one did you get? Um, I Lainey got Sirius Blacks because he's my favorite. I think we're going to go to Honey Dukes now. We were unfortunately not one of the people to get chosen to get a wand. Do they get those for free when they get chosen? They always pick the kids. I'm like, they're yeah. not the generation who grew up with this. Pick yep. me. Yeah. Oh, nice. Look at how cute these corn cakes are, guys. Oh, wow. I'm really hungry. I think I'm too hot to be hungry. Do you want to do a real selfie with my camera? Sure. It's magic. It'll look, make everybody look really good. Really? I can't even like, see what's going on. Okay. I think it counts down for two. I don't know if I did it. I think my eyes are twitching. There's the Hogwarts Express. 
We're about to go take the Hogwarts Express to Diagon Alley. trying to make it to the cab, the cab, the Uber, whatever, the curb, that's the word I was looking for, the curb to get an Uber to go back to the hotel because we don't really want to get poured on since Kayla and I got poured on last night. It's not something they really want to do again. Even though I brought my umbrella this time and I was prepared, still don't want to get rained on. Thank you for visiting. Oh, thanks for having us universally appreciated. We just finished having a, what, like two hour discussion about Game of Thrones. <laughs> And now we're going to head over to Connor's room and get dinner, maybe? Maybe have alcohol? There's alcohol. Alcohol. Lainey wants to have the alcohol. I do. I'll be having some water. Look, there's a water slide on this pool. Well, several hours later from we left the park, and we left because we thought, well, partially because we thought it was going to downpour, and it still hasn't rained yet. Look at the highlighter. It's I'm just the giving best. myself a breather. No, the highlighter's the worst. Some of these aren't bad. How is it picking out foundation? Did you get the right color? <laughs> I don't know. I, 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 I did the best thing. <laughs> right? Yeah, I'm going to say that. It's off. If you just <laughs> like, the whole thing might look great. His foundation is like three colors too dark. <laughs> <laughs> this is the highlighter. <laughs> bad selection for not knowing anything. I thought it was yeah. funny when you were like, ah, eyebrows, I don't know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, so it is the next morning. We gotta start the vlog. It's like 9.30, and we're gonna head down to BookNet Fest. Yay! <laughs> Pretty much update. Um, also, the LCD sound system is on the There she goes. Yeah. Marina, nice. there she goes. Yeah. Vlogging, vlogging as you do, Anna. Kayla's about to vlog too. Yeah, I was. As you do. I was. Hi, my name is Lainey. Uh, my channel name is Ginger Reese Lainey. And the last book that I really loved, I actually just finished. It's called uh, Devils and Thieves by Jennifer Rush. It comes out in October. And it's kind of, I would compare it to Sons of Anarchy with Magic. So it's the perfect fall book, I feel like, because there's witches and there's magic and abandoned buildings and woods and magical festivals. I'm Allie. My channel name is Hardback Horror, and that is very true. You can now see my house. My name's Thomas. My channel and website are SFF180. The last 
book that I read that I loved uh, was The Stone Sky by N.K. Jonathan. My current work in progress, I've talked a lot about on my channel, the working title is Shark Hollows. Uh, the best way to describe it is that it's about Shark Hollows. So there's a lot of it's fantasy, why fantasy, and I was complete. It was complete, and I was gonna start ferrying it soon. Until recently, I decided that I needed to rewrite the whole thing from the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> so that's where I'm at. <laughs> Father was my first like a YA book that I really read and identified as this. Hi, I'm Carmen. I'm the other half of YA Wednesdays. And uh, like Anne, my first YA book was Twilight. My first YA book was Twilight too. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't do it on purpose because they thought everybody was going to answer Twilight. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of did do it on purpose. <laughs> Nowadays, I just, I don't like even seek it out. Like if it's happening, I kind of leave. <laughs> I mean, I'm like probably the opposite of everybody on this panel. I'm like, oh, what is everybody saying? <laughs> I'm gonna make a 32 part Twitter thread <laughs> because you need my opinion, promise. I'm taking a break for lunch. This is the extent of my vlogging today. <laughs> we are now eating lunch. Just finished lunch. Clearly, I did not finish lunch because I'm still eating my pizza. But. <laughs> Connor's also vlogging. Um, We're heading back down to this way. We're going to Connor's panel. He's on a game show, which none of us really knows what that means. So it should be interesting. I'm currently running back down to the lobby because I forgot my books, the books for trade. I remembered them on Thursday when we didn't need them. And then today I forgot them. So I just ran up here real quick to grab these. I have some fruit snacks. Uh, don't want to drop them, and the panel starts in like five minutes, so I'm running. This is the game show panel. I know a lot of you guys weren't really sure what it is, and we weren't really sure what it was either. We're just like, let's roll with it. They collect some of their favorite hate comments, <laughs> and they are going to dramatically <laughs> read them. All of my hate comments usually are on videos that I do with my dog. One of them was like, what is wrong with you? Nice dogs, though. This is like my first YouTube message, and she messaged me something about feet, which I like don't remember, and I obviously <laughs> didn't respond. <laughs> And then, but I do vividly remember her messaging me and saying, so you're a size eight and a half for your shoes. Could you mail me your shoes that you don't wear anymore? And that's just creepy in and of itself. <laughs> I also emphasize eight and a half, but I really never said that on the channel. <laughs> this guy, I'm assuming it was a guy, left a comment that asked for, like, if he could guess what color toenail polish I was wearing, he would give me, like, $50, but I would have to prove what nail polish I was wearing with a picture. First off, Warren, I just want to thank you so much again for the continued support for being here, for making this a wonderful first year for Bocat Fest. So thank you. We just finished the last panel of the day, and now we're at the mixer, vendor mixer, I think is what it's called. There was a book swap. I swapped in Carry On a Passenger, and I got Black Hearts. Waiting for the raffle thing next. All right, here we go again. So you can take anything from this two, side. Two, seven, zero, nine, zero. We're all winners here. Come on, guys. <laughs> Why do you cramping think my style. Until um, let Lainey tell you what we're doing. Okay, so right now it's Book Next Fest is over. <laughs> you still said it weird. <laughs> <laughs> and we're sitting in the lounge of the hotel and we're waiting for Sam and Mari to finish doing what they're doing and then we're gonna eat and drink and film some tags. <laughs> and drink. We're doing the book makeup tag on counter, so that'll be fun. <laughs> And I won a book. I won more. Actually, no, I didn't. No, I won. <laughs> I won that book. And then <laughs> she won this one, and then was like, um, we're trading. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so that's how I got that book. And now I'm excited. So now I have something to read on the plane. I also have something to yep. read on the plane, <laughs> but I did not win it because I don't win anything. <laughs> they are getting ready to head downstairs to meet up with Mari and Sam and Connor and Mike, maybe. I don't remember who all was coming. We're going to go get some dinner. Okay. What? What? Oh. So sorry. 
They're stir fry. Guys, look at this extra butter. It's in the shape of seashells. Extra. It is. It's that's very extra. Bougie butter. <laughs> 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 so we just finished dinner and we're gonna head over to Connor's room. We're gonna do the book makeup tag on Connor, which I think will be super hilarious. Maybe film some other videos. That's that's about all I have to say right now. <laughs> the troops are coming in with the makeup. That is That's not sketchy at all. What's that little? I know. Is, that, <laughs> is it like two people? I don't know. <laughs> that is weird. It's pretty loud. It's like crotch level. <laughs> is it a oh, second people? Shit, yeah. yeah. That looks like that's for some um, inappropriate kids. room service. Kids. Yeah. For kids. That's Your not what I was thinking. I like want to see what it looks like. <laughs> That's weird. I said we're going to be doing the makeup book tag. A listen, lot. listen. <laughs> Can you see my eyes like George Washington? <laughs> <laughs> the whites of your eyes. It's weird how things stick in my head. <laughs> but it's always stuck. I need like a straw. <laughs> Those are actually um, real problems that we have. You got, you no, that don't look like a duck face. And then, uh, 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 and then go straight, look straight down. Down, your, yeah, and then pop the bottle in the bottom. No, 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 no. <laughs> just open it. Yeah, and then put your hand Dead. under. Make it more delicate. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, can I see that? <laughs> I can see it. I'm breathing. Fingers don't hang. Like you have to hang on. <laughs> like relax. Just like okay. be with it. Just be with it. Can you wake him up, and Anthony? <laughs> He knows. <laughs> Can you make me another one of your magic? We need more oh, drinks. Really? The Summoner series for me because the like Ooh. when oh. an author ends every single chapter on a cliffhanger, mm. I automatically just yeah. keep reading and <laughs> you're spilling on yourself. No, it's just really full. It's Tony's fault. <laughs> He's really tired. <laughs> Spilled you. <laughs> <laughs> and she goes like this. <laughs> Summer series. <laughs> Every chapter ends on a cliffhanger. I swallowed. <laughs> Hey guys, so it is the next day. It's Monday. I thought I would do a little sign off wrap up clip for Book Net Fest. I'm home at like 1.45 in the afternoon, two o'clock ish. I took a five hour nap because I was so tired because I did not sleep 
for basically like three days. This lipstick right here in the center did not come off. Nonetheless, I had the most amazing time at BookNet Fest. It was so much fun. It was like the best community event that I have gone to. I've only been to two, so I'm not an expert at all, but it just felt like the online book community. It was really represented and really appreciated and validated. I felt like it was an event for us and for topics that we discuss on the regular online and there's a chance for us to discuss in person. So well done for being a first event. Can't wait to see what Mari and Sam do with it in the future and how it grows and what it turns into. I think it's going to be a wonderful annual event that people look forward to for many years to come and I'm so proud of them and all the work that they put into it and then how it all came out in the end because it was just such a great experience. Thank you so much to Mari from My Name is Marinez and Sam from Thoughts on Tomes for putting together this amazing event for the community. With that being said, I have nothing else to say other than I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I hope that you got to feel a little bit connected to the community through the vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, I will talk to you very soon. Bye!